Please welcome Adam Hess, President, and Marisha Miles, General Manager from the Off-Broadway League. So for the last 59 years, which is the age of our organization, we have, uh, uh, like Blanche Dubois, depended on the kindness of strangers, we, uh, are, we're a volunteer organization and um, it's really been our members who have, have um, you know, really stepped up and uh, propelled this uh, organization. But this year, we hired our first full-time position, our general manager. Um, the Off Broadway League is grateful for the support of so many individuals and organizations, and we would like to thank Victoria Bailey and the Theatre Development Fund for their ongoing support of these awards. We would also like to thank our wonderful hosts this evening, Laura Benanti and Jeremy Shamos. As well as all of our talented presenters and performers entertaining for us this evening. The League wishes to express as our gratitude to the Performers Unions, Actors Equity Association, American Guild of Musical Artists, American Guild of Variety Artists, and SAG-AFTRA through the Theatre Authority for their cooperation in permitting these artists to appear on stage tonight. We'd also like to give a special thank you to our musical director, Michael Mancini. And to our director tonight, Michael Heitzman, who is in his, he is in his ninth year of putting on this show, this event. We hope you will join us in applauding the Lortel Administration Committee, which has worked tire tirelessly throughout the year planning tonight's event, and the award nominating committee who saw 96 eligible shows. Unbelievable. We'd also like to thank all of our volunteers who have made everything run so smoothly. Uh, the Lortel Award has been the gold standard of theatrical excellence. Uh, this year, the statue was reimagined by our art director, Bradford Lorick, and is a piece of art not only invoking Lucille Lortel herself, but her legendary commitment to off Broadway. Thank you, Bradford. <laughs> Further, these awards would not be possible without the dedication and support of her enduring foundation under the leadership of George Forbes and the amazing Lucille Lortel Foundation staff. On Valentine's Day in 1998, a musical exploded onto the off-Broadway scene, unlike anything we'd ever seen before. <laughs> Told in the style of a concert, the audience was invited to watch the performance of an East German rock band fronted by genderqueer lead singer Hedwig Robinson. And just like that, everything changed. Created by Stephen Trask and John Cameron Mitchell, Hedwig and the Angry Itch was a groundbreaking triumph in the 20 years since its, its debut at the Jane Street Theatre. It, it has been performed around the world, including in 2014, a Tony Award winning production starring Neil Patrick Harris. Tonight, I have the honor of introducing Stephen Trask, the composer and lyricist of Hedwig, and Justin Craig, who played the role Stephen played on Jane Street on Broadway. Ladies and gentlemen, Justin Craig and Stephen Trask. Look what you've done You gigolo You know that I loved you, hon And I didn't wanna know That you're cool Seductive serenade of your tree you jig on oh, oh, oh. of all the riches you've slain and all that you can't lift I'm just another dollar that you made in your long, long grip
Look what you've done You gigolo Another hustle Has been run But now you ought to know That this fool Can no longer be prayed on By the tools of your tree Walk on road in the sprint to your long, long drift. The love that had me in your grip was just a long, long grip. Heart burnt dry a dream or a song that hits you so hard filling you up sudden 